Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are the most famous couple in the world at the moment. They recently made international headlines when they announced that they would no longer be official members of the British royal family and would give up their titles. This news came as a shock to the monarchy, as well as to the British people and to the rest of the world. In March 2021, the couple sat down for an interview with Oprah Winfrey, where they shed some light on what their royal life was like and why they gave it up. Such a decision comes with a big ripple effect. Here is how life has changed for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle after the interview. The interview included allegations from the couple that an unnamed family member raised concerns before Archie's birth about how dark his skin would be. Meghan also made several claims that life in the palace was so difficult she had contemplated suicide and had received no help when she reached out. This has created a rift between Harry and his family, as we saw during Prince Philip's funeral, where Harry didn't speak to his brother or his father. Many in the public have sided with Harry and Meghan, reminiscing on the stories that Lady Diana told about private life in the royal family. Many calls for investigations into racism by the royal family have been initiated by the public, something that is causing quite a headache for the palace. One of the main questions that arose as a result of this interview and their royal departure among the British people is, should we still have a monarchy at all? Leaving the royal family has come with its criticism, but a recent poll by YouGov states that 45% of British citizens still have a positive view of Prince Harry and his actions. As a result of this ordeal, Harry and Meghan, now living in California, have begun campaigning for mental health initiatives around the world. In 2021, Prince Harry announced he had partnered with Oprah Winfrey to produce a series focused on tackling the stigma around mental health. The show is titled The Me You Can't See and seeks to broaden the conversation around mental health. For her part, Megan has become an anti-racism activist, raising awareness for this issue on her social media platforms. It's unclear where the future lies for the family. Whether they will ever return to a royal life remains to be seen. The question is, will the monarchy be permanently affected? Royal experts believe the monarchy still seems likely to survive, but any changes to adapt to the times will be subtle and slow. 